for those, again, of you that don't know me, uh, I am the bride's father, Stan Wiedemann. Um, thank you. Thank you. Um, in, in my 53 years, I've been proud to have been called a lot of things, a lot of titles. Um, I've been called coach, president, vice president, friend, son, not a rock star, no, son, brother, husband, but my most, the title that I'm most proud of is being called dad. I would like to thank everyone who has made today possible, especially Stan and Kim and Gary and Kim. And also, thank you all for coming to celebrate Matthew and Paige. I know they are so excited to celebrate their day with you all. And Paige, thank you for picking me to stand by your side, and especially for making me stand on this stage to give my speech as if I wasn't nervous enough. First of all, I'd like to thank all of you for coming out tonight. Matthew and Paige's wedding to celebrate this beautiful day. For those of you that don't know me, I am Blake, Matthew's first cousin. Anyways, for those of you who may not know me, my name is Chelsea. I am one of Paige's best friends. Paige and I may have known each other for like a really long time, but we haven't always been that close. I went to St. Nicholas and Paige was that cool girl from Sunman who came and played basketball at St. Nicholas and showed us all up. So we didn't really talk much then. <laughs> it wasn't until Matthew brought her around that we became super close. Matthew and I have been together for a long time. Tough and poor times, some of them, too. Little League Baseball and some CYO basketball together to the barnyard baseball games and dodgeball we always used to play when we were little kids. So my family hosts this big party every year and one year he was like, I gotta go get my new girl and he pulled around the corner and I was like, is that Paige Wiedemann? I know that chick. <laughs> and that's when our friendship really grew. So Matthew, I guess I owe you a huge thank you for finally bringing her closer to me and showing me how great she really is. Paige, take this ring. Paige, take this ring. It's a sign of my love and fidelity. It's a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. The Son. My Son. And the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. Matthew, receive this ring. Matthew, receive this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. The Son. The Son. And the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. I will never forget the day that we met Paige. It was a Sunday afternoon. As we would like to call it a Sunday fun day. At the Ertl residence. I think... 90% of the people here were there to join us when Chris from eHarmony showed up one day, said, Matthew, I have this girl I'd like to call. I'd like you to meet. Next thing you know, a couple hours later, here we are. Paige showed up at the door, and we take her in. All of us, kindly. Either way, by the end of the night, Paige was there, and when she left, Matthew was very excited. We had a great time. I'm not going to get into details about all of it. But either way, we had fun. Now, for all of you that really know Paige, you know she's definitely a good time. Paige is the queen of making jello shots. She's the best rapper and an even better karaoke singer. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm 
not quite sure how we survived any dirty half dozen party without you. And besides that, she has the best dance moves. You'll see her later doing the head banging. And she'll ask for a Tylenol after it. But on a real note, I am so grateful for how close we've gotten over the past few years. Whether it be us venting about the boys, talking about the latest gossip, or complaining about wedding planning. Now you get to listen to me. Yeah. I always know that Paige will be there, and she's always up for a good jeeping adventure, or even better, a good girl's night at home whenever we need one, which is a lot. After that, it had been a couple long years, and Matthew finally asked Paige to be his wife. And you can tell on the 4th of July that he was so excited for everybody to know. Either way, it was the most exciting thing for all of us to have Paige welcome into our family. I wanted to say thank you very much, and for everybody to have a good time tonight, I want to thank Aunt Kim and Uncle Gary, and Stan and Kim for having us here tonight. From here on out, let's enjoy ourselves and be safe, and party our cock stars. Everybody have a good time. And Matthew, oh Matthew, where do I even start with him? I've known Matthew all of my life, and growing up he's always been one of my favorite family friends. He's always been the life of the party. He and Paige are perfect together for a bunch of reasons, but especially because he definitely has an act for singing too. In fact, maybe later the Pork Pistols will get together and sing Elvira. Not only that, but Matthew also has his own signature dance moves <laughs> that I'm sure you'll see later. But seriously though, I'm so happy for the two of you. It's crazy to think that I literally watched your relationship grow from the beginning. And it makes me so happy to be here to celebrate your big day. I am so excited to watch the two of you continue to grow as one. And I can't wait to see what your future holds for you guys. 